he did taking my kitchen. They were conspiring. Bill would never do that. Oh, Jesus. Teresa! Get in here! What are you doing? Whatever I need to. Put down the knife. No, I'm gonna make him pay. Travis deserves to be punished, but not like this. The food will last longer without him. Wasn't that Travis's argument? Yeah, I was just playing devil's advocate. Shut up! Nitwit! Pipsqueak! Freak! How does it feel? Do I hear a little mouse whimpering? Stop, Arlo. You've made your point. Oh, no. Arlo? Go to Bill. Quick. He's still alive. Stay back. I mean it. I don't want to hurt you. Just Travis. I'm not going to let you. Back off. Yeah, back off! Shut up! Come on, Arlo. This isn't who you are. Maybe it is. Maybe I'm tired of being made fun of. Maybe I'm tired of being afraid. I'll be good, I promise. Fine. Go ahead. Stab him. What? But if you do, I'll hate you for it. You were my only friend here. I trusted you. You can still trust me. Now give me the knife. For the love of God. Oh. I don't think he's going to make it. The cut is deep. Samantha, Samantha, I'm so sorry. Who's Samantha? It's his daughter. I'm sorry, Bill. I didn't mean to. I just thought. Arlo, bandages, all right? Anything you can find. Torn clothes, towels, I don't care. Should we be putting our trust in him after this? We don't have a choice. He's unstable, dangerously unstable. Yeah, well, right now he's who we're stuck with. I see your point. Teresa, Bill knows things about this place. We've got to get him to tell us in case if he won't talk, that's his right. Screw his rights. If we lose him, we lose a chance to escape. How very cutthroat of you. Great. Anybody know what to do now? I'm afraid we're gonna have to sew up the wound. It's too wide. Do we have any thread? I'll go look. Hurry. He's still bleeding. I should press harder. Here. You know, if you all are tiny, I can help. We don't need your help. Well, you just said you couldn't trust Arlo. What if he stalls? Bill will die. At least I didn't stab anybody. Mostly. Let me help! Tell me about anything. I wish the windows are frozen. 
Did you see? Yes, yes, I remember. Adam's arm had been equally distributed in space. Room temperature. They dance. It's beautiful. like there's going to be one less mouth to feed after all. I never meant it. I didn't! You know Astra's never going to trust you again, right? You blew it, buddy. I just made a mistake, that's all. I'm the same person I was before. It was an accident. I got mad. No, oh, you're like me now. You're on the outs. I can make it up to Bill. Those are cold. No dancing with the cold. Looks different like that wall. I threw the bottle and smashed it. Yes, the wall. It fluttered, I remember, like it was made of water. Oh, quantum fluid. Extreme low temperature. One nano kelvin over absolute zero. Too cold for cohesion. Acquired, a, acquired gravity in a magnetic container to keep objects in pre flux form. It's not possible. It's not possible. It's okay. Let him sleep. I'm almost done. Did you understand any of that? <sighs> not much. I didn't mean to hurt him like that. I just wanted to... I'm not passing judgment on him. We just have to pray that he makes it. He doesn't believe in God. He told us. No, he doesn't. If people who have near-death experiences see this house, what will Bill see when he dies? Where will he go? Will he stay here? Will he come back to us? I have no idea, Arlen. Sorry. What are you going to do with that? I don't think any of us should have it. As we've just seen, we're all too fragile. We can't actually get rid of it, though. No doors, remember? No windows. Then I'll hide it. No, leave this me. Why you? Because I'm either kicked, stabbed, nor choked.
seen the blackness. It's just a shroud. No, it's no. The absence of matter. The emission of space and time. The void isn't something malevolent. Merely oblivion. Uncaring. Unfeeling. Unsensing. Oblivion. Well, somebody's out there. I wish you could open the door and go check it out. Me too. Hey! Shh! vibrations tell you if there were someone out there I should be aware of it but there's nothing just the same feeling I've experienced all along the darkness the emptiness This house is secure. We can't get out of here. We've checked every door, window, and chimney. Yes, but what makes you think something else can't get in? It's dangerous to assume we're protected. They're patient. They prod, and they test, and search for a way in. It's a game! The boss is having us on! It's the torture routine of the day! Travis, I assure you, whatever is happening is according to no human plan. They are outdwellers. Outsiders. They wriggle from my touch. It's almost as if... This is no time to be cryptic. Amen. It's as if they possess no souls. Simply ripples. Barely more present in mind and spirit than the darkness that surrounds and blankets them. What do you think they want? Unless... Unless what? To take the sinner. There are no sinners, I assure you. Is it me? I mean, I'm the one who committed a crime. Attacked Bill. Do you think these things have come to get me? Get yeah, Arlo. That's it. They're coming after you. Whew, my relief. Anyone hungry? We're not in danger yet. They're still smelling things. Foraging. Hunting. stopped. I wonder what that means. I really think we ought to recheck the house, all the windows and doors. Again? Where's Bill when we need him? 
This is no time for games, Travis. We really need to stop fighting. How do you know? Maybe these guys are here to set us free. Have you thought about that? Yeah, man. It's the Soulless Rescue Squad. <sighs> Fine. I'll check the back door. I'll check the sunroom. There's an exterior door there. You come with me, Arlo. We'll check upstairs, all right? Nothing. It's so quiet now. Do you think they've left? No, the way Teresa described them, they don't sound like quitters. Do you think what I said downstairs was right? They're here because of what I did? I did not come to call the righteous, but the sinners to repentance. Is that what you mean? Is this the snare of the devil? I don't know. You're really freaking me out! I'm sorry. But all I can say for sure is this. This house reacts. It responds to us. It's shown me things, and Bill too. Maybe there's a plan. Maybe these things are a part of that plan. The needle and thread appear just when we needed them most. Why would stumble across them? Yeah, I don't understand that either. Is it Providence or something else? But our actions impact our world here. Did that sound nuts? Only the scripture part. But if what you're saying is right, then that means they could be coming after me because of the fact that I heard Bill. Part of me wishes they would come. Then maybe we could catch one and find out what's happening. I'll never forget that face at the window. It was the most horrible thing I've ever seen. Me.
You said something about an attic, that you heard noises in the attic. It's a pull-down ladder. It wasn't locked. <sighs> Come on. Arlo. We're back into the dark. So, what did you see up there? It was like the house repaired itself right before my eyes. The outdollars must have discovered an opening on the roof before it sealed itself. Pried it open like a tin can. It's creepy as hell. That could just be my interpretation. I also felt one more thing. Now they know we're here, and they know we have what they want. Warmth, light, food, life. There's another thing we know for certain now, too. Unless those things were our wardens, no one came for us in our time of need. No guards, no warden, no scientists either. So, we're on our own. Truly alone. You're forgetting the people I trained with, studied with. They know I'm here. They won't stop trying to bring me back. I'm certain of that. And if that happens, you can be sure I won't stop trying to bring you back either. Yeah, but how do you stage a rescue at the end of the universe? Or in purgatory? I must admit, I have absolutely no idea. That's an admission I thought I'd never hear. I need to go check on that. Hey. Hey, what happened? Oh, nothing much. Arlo stabbed you, and then some soulless monsters broke in and tried to eat you. As long as I didn't miss anything important. Why did Arlo stab me? To put it in scientific terms for you. Persecution complex, I think. He thought you were conspiring with Travis. There's too many secrets around here. He's really sorry, Bill, but I'm sure he'll tell you that himself. Where's Travis? Did you untie him? Yeah. Funny thing was, we needed the bastard. Am I going to be all right? It still hurts. Teresa sewed you up, and I actually think she did a pretty good job. We're just watching for signs of infection at this point. When you were... Dying? You said some things. Did I? Something about quantum fluid? and containers that can hold it in certain forms. Laura said I talked in my sleep. The cat's out of the bag, man. Just tell me what you know. It's just me here. You know I can't do that. Look, nobody's coming, Bill. Nobody's watching either. If this is a prison, it's an abandoned one. And if anybody does come, it'll be more of those things. I don't think they care about your secret project. I want you to tell me something. Okay. Shoot. Your last name. I'm glad you're feeling better.